Hey guys, Richard here. So in this review, I'm talking about Coin 2.0. Now, this is a second version of Coin, which was released about six months ago. Everything on the sales page is exactly the same, so I'm not really going to go through that. But the big claim here is it's going to get you $39 in free Bitcoin every 12 hours. So we are going to jump inside. We'll have a look around, and then I'll show you exactly what's changed in this. And then we'll talk about the method itself, and maybe some of the things you need to watch out for if you're buying any kind of software like this. So guys, this is due to be released on the 22nd of October at 11 a.m. Eastern, and this is by Billy Dar. Hey guys, we just wanted to give you a very, very quick recommendation. Now, if you want to start making money online and you want to figure out how to generate lots and lots of free traffic, I've got a great recommendation for you, which you can literally pick up for the price of a pizza, guys. What I want you to do is jump down to the bottom of this video and you'll see this link here. Just go ahead and click on that link and you'll come over to this page here. Fill in your name, your email address, and click the consent here, and then you go ahead and you can get started with this product, which literally is the way that I started out online, guys. This is a very, very simple way for generating traffic. It's super easy to set up. There's 50 done-for-you niches included in here to get you started very, very quickly. So guys, if you're interested and you want to start building a business online, this is literally the price of a pizza. Go ahead and check out the simple traffic blueprint. Thanks for listening, guys. Let's get back to the review. So guys, as I said, this has been released before. Basically, this sales page is all the same. There's nothing changed on here. No testimonials have changed. Nothing's really changed. All this financial proof that wasn't really proof in the first place. None of that's really changed. It's just a slightly different version of this software. Now, what they've added is these two pieces here, this mining and this airdrops. Everything else is pretty much the same. And there is a bit of additional training I noticed. Now, if you want to see my other review, there is a review that I did again six months ago on this. When was this? April 2022. And you'll see here that this interface is very, very similar. So you can go ahead and check out that review as well. But basically what I'm going to show you here is the big differences. What you have here is a bunch of plugins that they put onto one site for you. So there is some useful stuff on here, to be honest, away from all of the financial nonsense about earning $39 every 12 hours. If you were just to buy coin, just to have somewhere that a lot of information was in one place, then this might be useful for you. 17 bucks, it might be just a useful little interface for you. And again, that's away from the actual how you're gonna make all of that money, because I'm gonna go through some of the money-making methods here today. So you have this home here. It's going to give you all of the latest Bitcoin numbers. Again, these are all plugins. Every single site that you see like this these days, any all of the exchanges have got these numbers. So this is nothing really new. But basically, some nice graphs here for you to have a look at. And some crypto news underneath here. Not sure how new some of this is. If you see this, <laughs> some of the published dates here, everything seems to be the 11th of the 6th. So I'm not sure where that crypto news is coming from. But basically, that's what's on the front page. Then you have some exchanges here. Now, this is a, a full list of all different types of exchanges that allow you to buy and sell cryptocurrency. Now, one way you can actually make money from cryptocurrency is by being an affiliate for some of these exchanges. Usually, a lot of these exchanges will have affiliate programs. Let's have a look at this one. Again, I'm doing this completely blind. But if we go and try and... There you go. If I go and try and click on this and you join their affiliate program... If somebody comes over to your crypto site, which could be the coin site, and clicks through and then joins up here and spends money, you can get a very, very small proportion of that money in their affiliate program. So that's one money-making method from this. But again, I'm going to tell you, tell you the big drawback of having software like this. But let's just say that that is one way that you can make money. And there's lots of these different types of exchanges. So literally, you could, in theory have an affiliate program for each one. The only thing I'm seeing on here is I can't see a way that I can connect this to an affiliate link. Now, I'm looking through here and I can't see a way that I can change some of these plugins. I'm gonna have to go to website widgets on here. I can't see a way I can change those types of widgets to include affiliate links. So that's kind of a drawback for me because what's the point of actually recommending some of these sites if I can't make money? So that's one thing. And basically, next thing is the mining. Now, Bitcoin mining is huge. Now, if you don't know what Bitcoin mining is, basically what you're doing is two things. If you're doing it as a solo miner, you're kind of lending some of your computer processing power to solve transactions on the blockchain. Now, if that sounds a bit confusing to you, you may want to keep away from Bitcoin anyway, because it is 
kind of a minefield once you get into it and it is quite complex but if you want to get into all of that stuff and really learn about that stuff it is a way that you can make money the problem is because you've got very limited processing power you're you're actually being asked to solve these transactions on the on the blockchain and the speed that you solve them will give you a very very small proportion of bitcoin that's the reason that people buy these server farms and have thousands of terabytes worth of processing power that they can actually go ahead and solve these transactions super quickly and you end up in a big queue so very little transactions you end up solving in the first place so in essence what you end up doing is getting a very very small amount of money now i know this because i've done it myself on this computer i've actually put it on my PC and it runs all day as long as your PC is on using your processing power and basically the cost of it running all day with electric won't even be outweighed by the Bitcoin that you actually earn it is literally cents now I can show you that actually in their training video if I come over to their training video I'm sorry I'm jumping about here but this is useful to see if you look at this here he's actually started the mining on the PC on this demo video which is again if you look at this in the background you don't want to start having plugins that have all of this going on in the background it is quite scary for most of you on a pc but basically it's saying that you're going to get if you mine with his particular pc about 0.03 us dollars a day so that's like three cents a day so when they say it's 39 dollars a day that they're making passively if they're talking about mining you're going to have to have a lot of processing power to be able to get just $39 which is again which is why these guys who know what they're doing have massive server farms and they have cooling units it costs an absolute fortune to set these proper mining places up that's the big issue I have with mining the other thing you can do is you can actually rent kind of a, a space on one of these server farms so when you actually go on to the web and you start searching for crypto mining sites a lot of them will ask you to Pay a subscription and what you're doing with that subscription is you're actually borrowing some processing power and by doing that you're going to get some crypto in back now depending on the value of the crypto coin you could end up making a profit on that subscription it is kind of a a way that they can pay for their own servers to run and still mine the crypto currency so doing this on your own <laughs> very little profitability guys i've done this on my own i've had to actually had a go with some demos some other products that are reviewed and you get very very little in profit so that's the mining piece now basically what they're going to do is they're asking you to start mining you're going to go over to this nice hash and then you're going to come and you're going to join this you can download all of these different kinds of plugins and then you've got the ability to to buy into hash power which is this here if i buy hash power hashes are rented and basically they're renting processing power on there web and they're going to give you some prizes as well to do that that's what this is all about if you want to read up on it and get an expert's view of it because i'm by no means an expert go over to and read nicehash.com and read all about it there so that's the crypto mining piece then you have these airdrops now the airdrops are interesting again they're companies that maybe are releasing a new coin and they want to publish that coin and they'll do these airdrops where you go ahead and claim some free crypto again it's such small amounts of money guys it really is as i said to you earlier there is better ways to make money online but again if you're into crypto and you want to get into this this could be something you want to do uh, there is some news here the news feed on this website again none of this site you can make on your own domain so it's all part of this is solic.net domain which i said on my previous review is just the site they release all of their products on so for some reason that goes down this will disappear but you have your news on here then you have this block folio section you have a watch list on here which you can actually watch your favorite coins a dictionary here if you wanted to spend time going through this dictionary looking at all of the different terms again if you click onto any of these coinbase or any of them big sites they're all got their own training that you're much better off going through you have some tools here and you have some upgrades there now the training is, is kind of limited it's how to start bitcoin mining it's a description around the different currencies exchanges the news the dictionary the currency converter and the website web zip. so it's not really bitcoin training so if you want to get into bitcoin i advise you to go over to all of these bigger sites and actually go ahead and use this so guys you know i don't think this is really any harm i think their claims are a bit silly coin 2.0 is just a place where they put all these different plugins together if you're interested in cryptocurrency it could be worth paying out 17 dollars 
just to get something like this to have a click around it is very very much a shiny object guys it's not going to make you that much money and the mining go ahead and do some research on the mining because the actual return is very very small if you're a solo user and you're trying to do it on your own so guys let's jump into the otos again this is the exact same OTOs as last time. The world's one and only app that gets some $39 in free Bitcoin every 12 hours. They don't show you that anywhere, by the way. Every single demonstration they show, there's no Bitcoin in the guy's account anywhere. So why do they just show you these things? If they're gonna claim that, show you. Actually show you an account with these Bitcoins on them and show you how it's done. They just don't do that. There's an unlimited version here for $97. Again, it allows customers to enjoy unlimited usage, unlimited free traffic and more. If they could get unlimited free traffic, they would never need to pay an affiliate to sell this product for them because they'd be able to get free traffic. So why would they ever pay anybody commission? Um, Upsell 2 is this done for you system setup, $297. Upsell 3 autopilot edition, nothing's autopilot online. You always have to do something, that's $39. Upsell 4, this done for you campaigns edition, $39 done few campaigns in relation to what uh, an upsell five franchise edition you can actually sell this to other people so guys as you can see in summary this has all been done before this is just a complete rehash of something they did six months ago the only thing i can see different on the sales page is this 2.0 everything else is the same i'll put my other review in the description below if you want to go ahead and check out that but if you're looking to make some real money online go ahead and check out the product i recommended earlier in this review i think that is going to be a much better way for you to get started hope you enjoyed that review don't forget to hit that subscribe and notification bell until next time take care